All right. There we go. This time, we're gonna do it. I don't know what we're gonna do, but we're gonna do it. I don't think there's anything we need to bring there, because we have the land, the artifact. And I don't think we'll be able to carry anything else if we're carrying the artifact. And like for like. It doesn't let us bring any of our tools in either, if we're carrying their artifact to come in there. Alright, aligning flight trajectory, accelerating toward destination. So they're like gathered around the staircase as I enter. So what I gotta figure out is which way do I go after I get in there? I mean, I can't just walk up to the dude. And I can't stand anywhere with that's lit up. Because then they'll see me. They seem to notice me if I make noise. Now, the button for focusing... Doing that right click from key mouse to keyboard. That also causes me to walk more slowly. Could I conceal my light and use that button to walk more slowly at the same time? Because that might prevent them from hearing me. That might be enough to do the job. Every time I wake up in here and then I start to try to boost my jetpack. Doesn't work that way. Doesn't work that way, Wadam. guy here. Yep. Yeah. I mean, it slows you down, but it doesn't really sound like it changes the way your footsteps sound. If anything, it sounds like you're moving just as fast, even though you're moving much more slowly. Now, he doesn't notice you when you're walking around behind him. It's just when you get into the lodge that they seem to notice you stomping around. Now I'm being quiet.
piss with such behind you probably because some asshole like where do I even go will they see me if I go this way oh there's a candle there oh yeah they catch you I feel like there's something you need to do here. And I'm just not finding it. What if I just shine my light on them? I mean, that won't do anything. I don't know why I'm lighting those candles. I come back here, I guess. Ow! It's not permanent damage. That's dream damage. Like a like a U shape, almost like not quite a U turn, but similar. Get into the door. There might be something else there that I can use. Either another path or some sort of button or interactable. I need to look. I have the ability to extinguish things, but I don't think I can do that while I have my light concealed. successfully hide back here? Now I can't tell if they're... they know I'm here? Yeah, I think they know I'm here, but they just can't reach me. No? They're wandering back and forth. So, where do I go from here? That guy's like looking directly at me. He knows I'm here. I'm 
One guy is still staring at the fire. What happens if I just shine my light here? Can they even reach me? I'm kind of assuming, like, this is the furniture in their own home. They can probably get past it somehow. Yeah. I'm shining right at them. They see me. Oh, yeah, they can go past. They can go through furniture. Yeah. They can grab me through the furniture. Okay, that makes sense. It's a place to hide, but doesn't give me an opportunity to see where to go next. Let's try one more time. Okay. This might be my last chance to do this on this loop. but I think that's just the dream water. It's not the real world water. This is it? This is it? Cool. Short circuited. is alerted. That guy's alerted. Oh, they're coming towards me. He's gonna grab me. Yeah, he's gra grabbing me. See? <gasps> the dam's probably gonna break any moment now. doing a lot of this so if it's a little frustrating for you I mean it's mildly frustrating for me but at the same time I'm into it it's the good kind of frustrating it's like got a little bit closer and we are gonna do this I just don't know if I'm gonna do it tonight or not it's gonna take a few attempts try that same one again. If it's still not working out on this loop, then I'm going to go back to trying the tower. Ooh. Okay, so been speculating on what exactly they're trying to hide. But I mean, I feel like the ultimate goal is to get those three phase resonance phase symbols and unlock the vault. unlock the vault, then we'll probably figure out what exactly is going on with them between the Alkin and the, Al the Eye of the Universe. Oh, 
I'm not gonna bother with this raft. It's actually just as quick as to zip over here. Grab an artifact and zip back out again. First time one of those guys grab you and then they open their mouth, you're like, okay, is this gonna do the horror thing where it just like takes a bite out of you or something like that? When no, he just blows out your candle. It's almost kind of cute, really. blew up my candle. That's all you really needed to do. Okay. There's one. Almost probably at the staircase. trying to get in front of him. I could have. It might have helped, actually. Cut down on the number of dudes that might have caught me. But we'll deal with this. I like that. The music gets a little bit louder as you get closer. It's kind of that creepy sort of music. Kind of giving me some Black Moth Super Rainbow vibes. seem to be any other way to get up. And I'm thinking that's my goal, is I want to get up to the top of the lodge. Just not really sure why, or what I'm gonna do when I'm up there. he gonna go? Do I just keep following him? Is this guy gonna catch me? Oh, yeah, he's gonna catch me. How do you sneak past him? Like, he's standing right next to the door. No. Oh. Wrong one. This is not marshmallow time. This is serious business time. So this time what I'm going to do is I'm going to follow the dude and I'm going to be like right up his butt even after he goes up the staircase. another dude further ahead that I can catch up to. 
Doesn't look like it. Okay, well, screw that plan then, I guess. Oh, there's a dude. What am I supposed to do? Okay, so I'm thinking that's not the correct path. There must be some other way for me to go wherever I need to go. It's hard to see what's all around me in that room. Because if I were to shine my light just anywhere, I'm probably gonna get like shine my light right in their faces. Oh. Is this it? No, that's not it. Did I pass it? This is it here. starting to learn the layout a little bit better to the point where I can just navigate it myself without following. Okay. Are there any other doorways? If I pass by in front of him, will he see me? Oh, one of them is looking at me. So, that grabbed me through the furniture. <laughs> All right. We're going to meditate and we're going to try the tower again. Going to a totally, we're going to navigate through to the well, which is kind of a similar, oh, I forgot. Now meditate until the next loop. I forgot that meditating in front of the fire counts as sleeping. Which is kind of weird, but I mean, I guess it makes sense. Because I mean, maybe somebody would see those pictures that I saw and assume that, oh, them closing their eyes means they're meditating. That's the connection. wasn't an ability you had in the beginning of the game either. Or when the game was first released, rather. Not in the beginning of the game. In the very first loop, I don't think you have the ability to meditate or snoot or take a nap. Don't get meditate until after talking to Gabro. And it took me a couple of tries just in this save file to actually get it from Gabro. Alright. Let's rotate. Whoa. Ouch. That didn't sound great. Let's try that again. Zoop. Zoom. Zip it bow. Ouch. Okay, there we go. holding the F E as if letting go was going to be the thing that turned off my flashlight. That's not the case. That's not how that works. Come on, Ben. What do you think about? Oh, come on, let's 
get on the raft? Yeah. I don't know why I insist on using this raft. See, the thing is, it's not quite clear. I mean, I guess in this game it's never really quite clear what your end goal is supposed to be. You're... At a certain point you realize, as a player and as a character, that you're just at the end of the universe and all of the stars are dying out. But you want to figure out if there's a way, something that you can do about it. Nothing here screams to me that they have the technology to prevent the sun from blowing up. As far as I can tell, they're just trying to escape it the same as you. Maybe even more cowardly, but at the same time it's like they don't have infinite time loops like I do, so I can't really call them cowards for not wanting to die. Since as far as they're concerned, it's their only death. a very generous 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 range for that uh why is that not working oh it's already down jumping down. Where's the little... Okay, there's the path I can jump onto. Fuck. Okay, well, that's okay. Let's start at the beginning again. That didn't kill me last time I did that. I must have landed on a different path last time. So, we're gonna deal with these two dudes again, which honestly doesn't seem that bad compared to the number of dudes we were dealing with before.
Where do I go from here? Is there going to be another dude down the hall? Well... So there should have been two dudes, and I think I only passed by one. There's staircases on left and the right. for me. He can't see me, though. Oh, he's right there. There's more than one down here. Okay. I'm not even sure where I'm walking to right now. Taking the direct path does not seem to be the correct one. Oh, I'm just getting a message from a friend saying my stream is emo only. And I am aware of that. I'm just playing a game where I do not want to be spoiled on. Also, even if emo even if chat was on properly, I would not be paying attention to it at all. So I apologize. Maybe it's a little bit less fun for you, but in fact, a lot of this game probably isn't fun to watch. Since right now we're we're doing a lot of walking around in the dark. So my friend's volume is off too, so that was an explanation for him to not hear, I guess. Oh, they they caught me. Damn it. Alright. Also, I still have that subtitles at the bottom here <laughs> that he probably can't read because he's watching on his phone but that's okay <laughs> all right we're gonna give this another try I don't know how many tries I have left in this loop but we'll find out So, we've gotten past the one dude, but I was kind of surprised by the fact that there's a bunch more dudes down there, which I guess I'll just have to deal with. But the difficulty of these is kind of making me think, oh yeah, there's no way I'm going to be able to do... Actually, I'm a dummy. I think that's kind of the thing. I'm going to have to try to do this after the flooding. Oh, is he going to come down this way? I don't know. He's going to go the other way, I hope. 
Because that's the way... He, that's the direction he saw me in. But if he turns towards me right now, then I'm screwed. Oh, yeah, he turned toward me. Okay. Okay. Alright. So that's what we're gonna do. And there's the dam breaking. That's just as well. So we... Let's just get out of here. Because we're about to get flooded. Oh, we're on the tower, so it's not gonna hurt us too badly right away. So I think that's the strategy, is we can do all, all of them at the same time. It's just, I'm gonna have to go to the cliffside mortuary and basically wait for them to die out. Wait for the dudes to die out. Because they all died out at the same time when the water hit the first place. That, that, that shrine there. So I have to go to there first, then I go to here. All right. Let me think of how I'm gonna do this. So we need to, because the other thing about this one is you need to create, you, you need to, you, you need to light a torch that allows your boat to stop here. So what I have to do is start here, and then get out, go to here, and, and go to sleep here, and then travel around to the three different spots in the, while I'm in the dream world. Now that I think about it, it's doable. I just Updated have to... Ayo, I think you're a bot, so but thanks if you're a legit person. <laughs> thanks for following bot or not bot. Nobody click on their profile just in case they're a click bot. Alright, so I'm gonna have to restart. I'm gonna take a quick break anyway, so I'll deal with that bot. Bot, like if you're not a bot, then please emote in chat. I'm thinking you're a bot because I recognize that name, Haas. So we're going to take a break. And I'll be back in like two minutes. So I'll see you then.